UtahAutoFinder.com is just a click away. It's quick, convenient, and simple. With over 6,000 vehicles and a convenient calculator, you're sure to find a new or used vehicle that will fit your budget. Research cars, read reviews, get a quote, or contact a dealer. Utah Auto Finder. It's simply amazing. Thank you. You are authorized to enter this live operations area. Time is T minus 25 minutes. All right, shake the glasses. And here you have it, ST-1, first test motor for the launch abort motor of the Ares program. It is hanging essentially in an upside down position right now. This thing would be able to pull the capsule up and away. Now the nozzles are bent, they are not movable nozzles. There are four nozzles there that are bent to just a, a small degree so that as it lifts, it will lift the capsule up and away and bend away from the rest of the thrust of the rocket motor coming up so it puts the, uh, the astronauts in a, in a safe position. It's a brand new test stand. It's a brand new control bunker. It's a brand new rocket motor. So this is a system that you pretty much hope and expect you'll never need. But it's good to have as a safety backup. You look at this from a perspective of we spent months, actually years with the design, you know, a couple of years with the design and then building it, and months preparing for this test and it'll all be over in a matter of a few short seconds. Knowing that you're a part of uh, something that's not been done uh, very often, and in this case uh, will eventually lead to uh, travel back to the moon and beyond. Uh, I mean, it's all very, very exciting. T-minus 20 seconds. Nine, eight, Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. absolutely incredible. We've made huge amounts of progress today. Uh, three years worth of development effort we saw in this four second test. It's incredible. You could feel the pressure wave hit you. 500,000 pounds of thrust in four seconds. Oh, I'm so excited. I had tears in my eyes over there. I mean, we're trying to do so much with so little as fast as we can. And this was just a major milestone event for NASA. To see this system come along and what it means for safety is just extremely nice to see and very, very comforting for our future. So we're really pleased with it. I'm sure I'll look back on this as one of the highlights of my career, recognizing as we're successfully traveling back to the station, back to the moon and beyond. To be a part of that will have been a real privilege.